Good evening, everybody, and welcome to the new Mushroom Monday. Say, just a side note, we are new beginners, just learning. So this is going to be kind of helpful for those who are also learning and beginning because we're definitely going to be able to show you all the mistakes <laughs> through the way. So in this video, we are going to do something that is called Uncle Ben's Check. And what's happening here is, of course, we are getting that nice and hot to sterilize it. And this is some pretty clean and beautiful mycelium in this agar. And what's happening is that it's being transferred um, over to grain. So it's active mushroom mycelium from agar to grain. Um, and the method that's being used here, it's an improvised SAB, AKA still air box. All right, so as you can see, the Uncle Ben's tech is obviously Uncle Ben's because it is that 90-second rice bag. Um, oh, and a quick shout-out to 90-second Mycology on YouTube for the instructions on how to get this done. You can use um, rice bags from the dollar store, the Dollar Tree, I bet. What's happening is that the rice bags are then left for the mycelium to fully colonize with what's called um, like a break and shake or squash and mix. Once the mycelium is about 30% or so colonized, um, and that's gonna help speed up full colonization. And that will probably take you about um, up to three weeks. What you want to do is make sure you tape it off here in the corner once you've cut it. You're going to want to make sure that there is no open part for any contamination. And you don't want to fully close it, like fully, fully. If you see it's still somewhat open because you want it to breathe a little bit, but you don't want any outside air coming in there. Because later on, I'll show you what it looks like if you messed it up. So I'm very excited about doing Mushroom Monday. And one of the reasons why I wanted to bring this is so that other people can learn. Um, there are those that are doing it on very large scales with incredibly fancy, expensive equipment which is wonderful, but for those of us who don't have the room or finances for all that fanciness, we're going to do a little bit more inexpensive method. So join me on Mondays for more Mushroom Monday Madness, where we will continue to teach you methods on growing healthy mushrooms for your health. Thanks for joining, and we'll see you next time.